The Chicken Never Cross musical was inspired by the stories my friend Robert Jackson told me about his mother and her friend Marie, who ran a poultry and fish shop on Hastings. We're at the start of the stage reading of Chicken Never Crossed, how one shop lost to urban renewal. Little Shorty, played by Michael Sandusky, is much put upon and has the blues. Yes, ma'am. It cost that much, because when you asked me to wait for you a while, you went to the grocery store. Then you wanted me to drop you off at the church, and you spent 20 minutes talking with the pastor about Sunday service. And oh, Lord, it's been all day. played by Angela Davis, who tells us why she hates killing chickens, even though she's part owner of a poultry shop. The next morning, baby, I woke up and I had a terrible headache. I could hardly move, and then I looked in the mirror, and my face just broke out with all these little bumps. It was a curse. by Gail Martin, who hopes her shop is left standing, but of course it falls to urban renewal. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
we did try to open up another shop now in Spring, on the other side of the We were more patient than we were in the tank top. We went to the other side of the world. But one of the things that happened is that in those days, everybody could When people would walk to the store, these things were no walking. We lost the debris away because of it. It cut off a lot of people on the other side. So the traffic on this side is which one? And finally, John Sloan III and his Ghostlight Productions, as well as Nicely Theater and David Carroll, are responsible for the Obsidian Festival. Thank you for allowing black stories to be told.